Hey guys, don't you love that we put our best designs out ever and uh, they're only available for a very, very limited time and go off sale after Valentine's Day? Time is running out very fast. All right, guys, a new Roblox update is about to drop. What what can you expect in this update? Profanity, romantic themes and dating, gambling, alcohol reference and use. Awesome. All right, nine-year-olds, time to grow up. Uh, this sounds like a parody, but uh, this is this is real. For some, for some reason, this is real. Also, there's already so much gambling, right? Both of these are already like heavily, heavily encouraged. I have entire videos about these two. Too. Not me doing this, me uh, showing it, but I would not show profanity as that would get my ads taken away. And I would not do that. I would not do this the second I wake up, the, the second I brush my teeth, the second I uh, eat, eat breakfast. Recently discovered within the Roblox so, internal APIs, new age guidelines categories have been found. For those unaware, age yeah. guidelines are what restricts oh, certain players from accessing certain games. Listen to him. Wait, let's listen to him for a moment. Rating. The new guidelines include profanity, yeah, frequent or infrequent, romance and dating, romantic themes, so, gambling, either where, simulated, I don't know, unplayable, or depiction. They somehow of. found this in the like the some sort of code of a. I don't know. Did a hacker find it? Shout out Bloxy News for uh, getting me the scoop in a digestible format. All right, hear me out. I think this is probably gonna be a good thing overall. Let me let me explain. So I feel like Roblox bans games that are like not even offensive to like small children. Like Robio, there are so many Robio remakes because they deleted the original person over and over again. And now this game could just exist because Roblox is like uh, realizing that it's stupid to just only have like baby games. So now they're letting people make more like aged up games, you know, so I think on this they could like maybe expand They could they could let people make like like more aged up games Like I wouldn't mind a left for dead 2 on roblox, but the romantic themes dating. I don't know. What is that all about? What kind of games are you planning on releasing or are they trying to make a new category for uh, yeah for uh, Games like this where uh, old men can interact with children. I, I I'm sure it's not all like that But you know, I guess this update it's a good thing then like let's let's move the uh let's you know separate the ages a little bit in in games like this because roblox keeps them up and they show them to you like they purposely push these kind of games like the like dating related they push them up there because they could just put this this game has 3k players that why is this one above it they're showing me a wide variety of games but they really want me to play this one for some reason yeah if this code found in the actual like roblox i don't know files or whatever on their website something this is gonna be this is gonna be really interesting to see what they do with this and why are they going like they I think they knew that Roblox is a dead like revenue source without gambling people buy Robux mostly for pet simulator X plushies and that's that's by definition gambling and if getting children into gambling early is what needs to happen to keep Roblox around I'm willing to do it. I'm willing to encourage it. Who cares what happens in 20 years to all these kids? I I don't. I need the Roblox CEOs to be trillionaires. That cause is important to me. More important than having so many gambling games for kids. 0.05%. I'm going to buy 3 million of them and I hope I get it. Mom! To all those kids out there, while you're gambling, make sure to use star code flamingo because then I get a little cut off this whole gambling thing. Look, if you're gonna gamble, at least give a percentage to me. <laughs> All right, I, don't, I obviously don't mean most of what I'm saying, but I, I think this is a little odd. Alcohol reference, this seems like a big jump. There's like nothing in the middle of this. Like, sure, they might enforce this in like a couple years. Maybe this was a test and they're just like, oh, what's so cool? All oh, this. Like, maybe this could be like, uh, like those kind of like funny dating simulators. One of my favorite YouTubers, Game Grumps, plays those and it's, it's funny. So maybe we could cross it off the list as a really great thing. Gambling, Um, I think that's already awesome. I wonder if loot boxes are only going to be allowed in like aged up games so maybe a lot of pet simulator players like won't be able to access the game uh, if they're under a certain age maybe alcohol reference let's see no results found what the 
Yeah, I guess it's hard to find. I think they should have this for ages three and up. Ages three years old and up, I think is a good place to start. It's funny how if you type in date, like for dating, it kind of gives you games that people already do that on. I wonder if it, it has to have some type of algorithm that detects this, even though it's technically not allowed, because why else? Why else would it show me vibe hugs? It doesn't say date in the description at all. So why why would they show this? I think the Roblox AI is uh, like, what? Whatever their search algorithm is, it's programmed against the rules in a way. It therefore knows what like these kind of games are for, right? The Roblox machine is working against you. Do not give in. All right, what do I do now? Do I just go to a bar on Roblox? Maybe we'll unlock that category when uh when when this new update comes out. There's things to look forward to. But for now, we have to drink holy water. P.S. All the dislikes are offended little children. Dude, I love that. Stop online. Hey, that's my voice. Stop. And how poorly this audio has aged. Uh, this is me killing a man for just uh giving love a shot <laughs> there I, there i am again um i would like to point out that i actually i didn't make this game i didn't ask for it to be made that is so funny that specifically gambling was listed i know i already said this but it's crazy how important this actually is uh to keep the platform alive and growing look i just got a badge that means a bunch of kids are gonna be introduced to a casino and um uh, that's good i'm not gonna leave this game i'm gonna give people incentive to follow me well i mean this place is kind of a, a chill vibe time to play coin flip oh I'll, I'll play a little bit of coin flip whatever oh i'll bid a couple bucks it's <gasps> Get me out of here. I gotta get out of here. No, but I have to win my money back. All right, all or nothing. All right, he's heads. Let's go to land on. Please. I won! Ha ha! But I could do double. I could do double. Betting $50? Um, kind of cringe. This would be better if it was real money. I should go to a casino right now. All right, I'm heads. Please, oh, please. No! I have no more money. Roblox. Every single commentary YouTuber under the sun has um, made a video about this, and uh, I no, talk about it I guys, I'm actually breaking this story right now. I'm, nobody's made any videos about this yet. Nobody's, nobody's gonna care tomorrow. No, he's just trying to discourage me from making this video, actually. Because obviously that's what Roblox wants. They want to appeal uh, to everybody. You know, not just, you know, younger kids, teens, and uh, young- we, Yeah, we need the 50-year-old gambling addicts. I want to watch a man uh, gamble his house and all of his assets away. And then after he's done, he goes to, uh, you know, maybe he goes play his uh, natural disaster survival with a five-year-old. I like it. You might think I'm kidding, but I actually like this a lot. Most parts of it. I, th I, I felt like the gambling one was was like I feel like you're just slipping in that in there and like hoping we don't hope we don't notice that amongst a few other things I actually noticed I saw it said it I want to hear uh, a grown man on voice chat argue with his family over his gambling that's not true that's not what I want to hear but I will this probably won't be real gambling. Yeah, t t gambling simulation. Jake uh, added to this. He said, uh, uh, Dennis drinking problem daily. That's insane to say. I like this. Finally, I can bend it. There we go. I guess this is like a technically a, a leaked thing that happened. How did people even find this? I wonder. Romantic themes, gambling, gambling. Um, I guess there's probably no way that Roblox actually addresses any of this if it was leaked or stolen code. I think it's probably some like actual like just 12 year old who figured out how to hack it. I feel like Roblox has a uh, really smart hackers. Who knows? But yeah, I'd be extremely interested in knowing a little bit more context on uh what each rule entails. Like how far are you allowed to take each of these rules? And like, what's the age guideline? Can people just set their age to be uh, 30? Uh, regardless, I think it'll be interesting. I think it's a good thing. Like I said, I want, I want cool games. And if it's gonna breed the next generation of gambling addicts, then that's Roblox's cool. That's cool. That's Roblox's cool decision is what I'd say. As a, as a star program member, Yes! Awesome!